Welcome back everybody, wherever and wherever you're watching. This is going to be my very first unboxing video. I've promised you this since, uh, you know, I made my order about uh, a couple of weeks ago. This is from Just Arrived Today in the Mail. You can see. Yeah. You can see. Um, from mycomicshop.com. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty excited to, uh, to getting this one. Uh, as you know, uh, R-95 actually talks a lot about, about uh, mycomicshop.com because that's his store, Lone Star Comics. And before I proceed to the opening, um, I do want to mention something that uh, R-Dowdy and I have in common. And it's not public knowledge, I guess. I, my middle name is actually Roberto which is Robert, so I'm a rap as well, and I was named after uh, my paternal grandfather who died three years ago, almost three years ago, three years ago next month, at the age of 100, and uh, you know, he died as he lived, you know, a very good life, he lived a very good life, and you know, he died a very good death as well, you know, he wasn't sick, he wasn't in, in a hospital, he, he died at home. You know, his senses were all there, he was very sharp. You know, he, he still you know, read the newspaper every morning, watched the news, you know, he was very informed. And uh, I even hear that, you know, a few hours before he died, you know, he was in very good spirits, he just, just died, you know, in his sleep. And, uh, you know, it was very sad for me, because, you know, he was a... Uh, a great man, you know, he really um, inspired me in a lot of ways, you know, he got me interested in old movies and jazz music, and uh, yeah, so, anyway, you know, uh, you know, just watching the videos from uh, from you guys, you know, I learned a lot of, about you, about all those great YouTubers out there, uh, you know, finding things that we have in common, uh, interest in that go beyond comics like you know for example if you've been watching hippies videos he did uh you know he did uh ask me one question about myself and uh you know i, I learned for example you know he plays a guitar i play the guitar and he was inspired by the beatles i was inspired by the beatles as well to playing you know guitar i haven't played in a while but yeah I, i'm a beatles fan that sort of came from my dad actually because I've been hearing them since I was very, very um, young. Uh, but, you know, it was after I heard A Hard Day's Night when I was 14 years old that I really got into not just the music, you know, personally, but they learned how to play the guitar. And uh, an aunt of mine taught me uh, how to play. So, anyways, here we go. I'm a... Uh, Actually, going through the uh, opening here. One of the things I love about uh, mycomicshop.com, my Star Comics, is you know they really pack their um, comics really, really well. That and you know, you know they give you a, a calculated time of arrival, and uh, you know they usually usually arrive before for that time so yeah okay so as I was saying telling you uh, about um, about this buy you know I got it at a, at a really great price which surprised me a lot because um, even a, a similar um, uh, issue went on sale as well a few days ago after I, I bought my copy for a bit of a, a bit higher from you know what I got got it from I actually paid um, $7.99 for this and shipping that included um, um, you know um, so and then the other one that I saw a bit later was um, actually just about 13 13 dollars so yeah really got a 
a really great uh, price for for this issue. And I mentioned that actually I believe Hippie showed it a while back. Um, this this issue. Um, so I I kind of been uh, you know holding. Uh, withholding myself from from actually um, you know buying this particular uh, series at least uh, this series from um, this particular period because a while back I actually um, read read it uh, online but you know I actually realized it was a lot longer than I um, than I feared because I actually forgot what the uh, story was so yeah here it is action comics number um, issue 328 from 1965 yep uh, actually he appreciated this one a while back it's it's a 5.5 and it looks, you know, great. It's got very, very few little things. And the $13 copy I saw a few days later had a lot more creases on the uh, on the front cover than, than this one. Actually, that's why I bought it as, as well, because it looks um, great. It looks far, far better than, than um, you know, Yeah, it looks, it looks wonderful, actually. And a very nice book. You know, a bit tannish on the uh, pages, but you know, the colors are still very, very sharp. You know, very... Actually, it's actually a, probably a bit higher, I guess. You know, it's got just a little thing here. Sort of like a little guess, crease here. I don't know if you can see it right there uh, but yeah I mean it looks very nice yeah and um, maybe the symbol might be a little bit rusted yeah, but solid you know they do look a little bit uh, rusted actually not that much but uh, you know the, the pages look wonderful you know and like I said you know I kind of um, it does have, I guess, it only has this right in here. You can see that's probably why why it uh, um, why it, uh, it it's a five point five. You know, because I guess it's like Lisa Hollers or I don't know Joe Holler or something like that. And uh, but yeah, besides that. You know, no, and no, I really don't mind the uh, actual writing on it. I mean, you know, this the pages. I really don't mind the writing on it though, because you know, it, you know, it belongs to someone who who actually read it and took very good care of it. You, know, you can really tell. You know, it was very well taken care of. It just it just looks wonderful. Really, really nice looking book. Um, so, let's cut a little few. So this actually makes it my my oldest uh, issue of Action Comics that I have in my collection so far, and. Uh, So, yeah, it looks like a really, really, so yeah, so this makes it my oldest collection, book in my collection of action comics. Uh, so it's a fine minus 5.5 .5 of action comic number 
328. There we go. So, anyways, thanks for watching. As always, you know, comment. Um, and I'll be seeing you next time with what I be with what I will be getting uh, net uh, this week for my pool. I hopefully, you know, it, there are no delays with with the stuff coming in because usually they come in today, but and they have them sell like in the afternoon. So usually we go Thursday or Friday to pick them up. So. If everything goes well, I'll be picking them up, picking them up tomorrow. But you know, no hurry actually, because uh, you know this week is kind of light, and uh, I will also be getting the Golden Age variant for um, Superman Unchained number one, which I really liked, uh, and uh, my. I, I saw it in my in my in one of the shops that I went to the larger shop was around like I think I told you was around 580 pesos so it was really way up and I find it for 120 so another eight dollar book I guess so yeah 799 for for this I, I told I, I I told you you know um, the the other one that they had you know had a lot of crisis in the in the uh, in the in the cover so anyways until next time keep smiling